What's up everybody, this is Danny and today I've partnered with Ecobee to show you their brand new smart doorbell camera. I've been on the Nest ecosystem for so long, but the way that Google's been neglecting smart home at the moment has me looking for better alternatives. With the addition of the smart doorbell camera, I feel like Ecobee has a convincing ecosystem with the combination of their smart thermostats and sensors, and all of these products work together as a home security system. It's all controlled through the Ecobee app, which I'm a big fan of, and it's all HomeKit compatible, which makes it perfect for my smart home makeover. I got a lot to show you. Let's talk about it. I have all the products here needed to show you the full Ecobee ecosystem, but first let's start with the star of the show, the new smart doorbell camera. Here's what comes inside of the box so you know what to expect when you pick one up. Everything you need is included to get started. The only thing that you might need is some basic hand tools. I needed a drill and a masonry bit because I have a stucco home exterior. Be sure to double check what sort of drill bit you need depending on if you're going into softer material like wood. The Ecobee app provides the step-by-step -step instructions you'll need. Here is a pouch of all the screws and accessories that you will need. And it also comes with a wedge that I highly recommend you use so you can angle your doorbell camera to get the best perspective. And finally, you get a chime adapter so your existing chime will work seamlessly and proper power is being supplied to the doorbell for the best performance. Even being tech savvy, I always have this underlying anxiety when I install smart home products because I always anticipate a hiccup or two. And while you can get a professional to install these Ecobee products, the installation process was so easy with the step-by-step -step instructions from the app. They were easy to follow and not intimidating, and the best part is support if you run into any trouble. After selecting my wiring combo, the app prompted me and I was able to send a picture of it via messenger. Just take a look at this. In real time, I was told exactly what color wire went where and that just blew me away. It was a perfect install the first time, so don't be afraid if you want to install it on your own. Previously, I was using a Nest Hello Gen 1 doorbell, so compatibility was not an issue. The Ecobee Smart Doorbell Camera was easy to install, but I used the wedge to get the best angle possible. All you need to do is use the base plate and screw that onto the wedge to make it one piece. I use the wire extenders with the wire nut since my wiring is a little bit short. Then once you get the holes drilled properly, screw the plate on and then just place the doorbell camera in. And there is a small security screw at the bottom. Use the provided tool to tighten it up and that's it. It literally took me 10 or 15 minutes, so easy install is a major go. So here's what the doorbell looks like. 1080p HD video camera front and center with two night vision lights, one on each side, the microphone underneath it, and another light sensor underneath that. There's a big doorbell button so there's no doubts on where to push with a light loop around it to make it easy to see at night. There is a reset button on the back just in case you need it and a speaker at the top and it sounds like this. Here is what the speaker sounds like outside when you're having a two-way talk. What do you think about the quality? When you fire up the Ecobee app, the smart doorbell camera is front and center. You can hit the view live button to get a live feed. The first thing that set out to me is just how crisp this 1080p video is. The HDR is legit and as you can see, all the details are there. This camera view is so wide, even with the wedge, I can see a lot of the wall, but then I can zoom in or out without losing visibility. And then when I go back and see the live view later, it goes back to that field of view, which I think is really great. Also, the visibility is fantastic because you get a head to toe view of the subject. So I'm enjoying this wider field of view from my previous doorbell. My kids were also enjoying this a little too much when the doorbell first got installed. Another thing that stood out to me is the night vision. My Nest Hello used to show up as only black and white video, but most of the time I can see color even with no lights on my front porch. I used to get a ton of false notifications at night no matter how I had the zone settings because of all the cars driving by shining their lights. But on the exact same zone settings, on the Ecobee smart doorbell camera, I'm no longer getting those 10 to 15 false notifications per night, so I'm definitely happy about that. And a lot of that has to do with the radar settings, which I'll show you a little bit later. All of the features that you expect from a high-end camera doorbell are here. I like the easy buttons on the bottom. You can two-way talk with this button here on the live feed, record it anytime with the button next to it, and even take a photo snapshot if you see something suspicious. It also has a siren, which I think is a great addition to scare off package thieves. The smart doorbell camera can even work as a part of Ecobee Smart Security, which I'll go over later. You can view all of your history with the button on the bottom. This camera doesn't record 24-7 video, but from using it for about a week, it looks like it's recording about two minute video clips per event. Some are shorter if needed. You can play them back by just tapping on the clip. And if you wanna share the clip, just hit this button up here to download the clip, and then you can choose wherever you want to share it. This is the app on the iPhone, but the Android version will be similar. If you hit the edit button up here, you can choose which clips to keep or delete if you wanna manage your recordings. 
When you dive into the settings, the thermostat live view is by far the best feature for my lifestyle. The big reason that I kept my Nest ecosystem is because as soon as you hit the doorbell, then it will give you a live feed to the Nest Hub, and I really found that convenient. But as soon as someone rings the Ecobee Smart Doorbell camera, the feed comes directly to the Smart Thermostat Premium. I can walk over and two-way talk from the thermostat, which is fantastic, or I can just see who's at the front door. And if it's someone sketchy like this, I definitely won't answer the door. Another killer feature is that the chime plays through the thermostat premium, so you definitely won't miss who's at the front door. If you have a multi-story home like I do, this can be even more useful if you don't have your phone nearby. I wanna get another smart thermostat premium so I can have this feature upstairs too. To round things out, here are the rest of the features in the settings. The detection section has a good amount of customization. You can turn on or off the motion detection, person detection, and package detection. Turning these on will automatically record when motion or person or packages are detected. The activity zone gives you customization over where it prioritizes detections. Just move it where you want it to be and that's it, super simple. Now this is what helped me minimize my false detections. With Ecobee's radar settings, you can choose from seven feet to 30 feet. So being able to customize that really enhanced this feature for me. This is something that I think many of you will be happy with. As promised, this is where all the Ecobee products come together to work as an entire ecosystem. I think the standout feature is where it comes together to become Ecobee Smart Security. The Smart Thermostat turns into the keypad so you don't have to buy anything else. This is so clever. You can choose to self-monitor or get professional monitoring as a part of the paid complete plan. This is either $9.99 per month or $89.99 yearly for a 30-day video storage for unlimited cameras. Another option is the standard plan for $4.99 a month or $49.99 yearly plan. You can get smart security for one camera or doorbell and self-monitoring. This is the plan that works best for me. You still get 30-day video storage, smoke alarm detection, and you can pause heating or cooling when the door or window is open with smart sensor for doors and windows installed. I think this is reasonably priced for all the features you get. What's great is the smart thermostat has an occupancy sensor built in so it can detect movements in the home after you've been gone. Plus the smart sensor that comes with this smart thermostat premium and is also sold separately in two packs can detect occupancy and temperature at the same time. If you need, you can get an Ecobee smart camera with voice control for indoors to view the unusual motion. With smart sensors for doors and windows, you get a notification to your smartphone if a door or window is left open for more than five minutes. And every time that you open that door or window, you can have a chime play and it sounds like this. And if the alarm is set, you can have it go off and it plays through the compatible Ecobee devices, including the smart doorbell camera. So this is a complete system. What I love about this is that you can add slowly to get exactly what you want, or if you wanna grab all of these products and have them work together, you definitely can. So I think this is a solid ecosystem for smart home security. So let me know, what do you think about the new Ecobee smart doorbell camera? Is this something that you're going to consider? If so, I'll leave a link down below so you can get more information and check current pricing. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one. I'm gonna activate the siren so you can hear what it sounds like. Okay, it's pretty loud. That's enough.